What's up, yo? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we take a look at another Lego order that I did from eBay this time. This is an eBay Lego order uh, of a couple of figures. Uh, not too special. There is quite a lot of figures here. I had to get this for like eight pounds and like maybe ten pounds in total. Uh, and there's quite a few figures here uh, for ten pounds. Uh, we are going to exclude this guy here and uh, this one here because they are not actual Lego, but they just came in the bundle. Because uh, we're not going to use these two. Because uh, they're not actual Lego figures. So we're kicking these two out the bundle. Uh, if you do want to look at them, here they are. It's like a skeleton dude and an army man. Uh, some weird shaped heads as well. Uh, but yeah, taking a look at the actual Lego figures. We have a Stormtrooper torso and legs with uh, a Power Miner's uh, headpiece there. Uh, looking pretty cool. One of the newest Stormtroopers, I do believe, because that printing is very cool. Um, we have Wildstar from the Lego Movie. Uh, who doesn't like Wildstar from the Lego Movie? Here she is. Very nice. Nice torso. We do have two Emmets from the Lego Movie as well. Uh, two Emmets here. A scared looking Emmet. And a happy looking Emmet. This is the exact same Emmet figure. Uh, obviously. Uh, so I have two of the same Emmet figure here. Uh, I did get, buy these for custom purposes. Uh, so here they are. Uh, moving on to the next one, which is Curl's head with a queen's torso and legs and some brown hair. Don't know why this bundle is a thing. Or this figure is a thing, but it's parts. Uh, we have a policeman holding a like a laser beam. Uh, some tough guy here. Some red hair, but that is old red hair. We also have a very old yellow. Uh, Neck brace, which hasn't been seen in a while. We've got it in green with Sky Pirates from Ninjago, but not in yellow. We have a Batman without a mask, uh, but it is one of the newer Batmans. Uh, it's Batman without a mask. Uh, we have Scottish Batman without a mask. This is a Batman I do not have, uh, but I do have a spare Batman helmet, so I will be able to finish this off and get my Scottish Batman on. Very cool. We do just have a random torso and legs here. Uh, very useful. Toss on legs is what I'm lacking in right now. Uh, if I'm lacking in anything, which I am. Uh, who is this? We have, uh, a tosser here from Lego City. Hair and a head from Lego City as well. Uh, looks like a very old head. Uh, could be wrong, but I can't take the hair off. Uh, that could be a problem. I would like to take the hair off. There we go. Pretty happy there at the back as well, but pretty scared as well. I'm not going to put the hair back on because I struggled to get it off. Uh, moving on to a firefighter, which looks like uh, Will Turner from uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, looks pretty cool. No hair or helmet, but still it's a firefighter. What's not to like? It's a very cool tosser, very useful one as well. We do have a very dirty beard here, uh, which is quite gross. Uh, not going to lie. I'm not sure if it's mild or just dirt. So we're going to put that down there. Uh, but we do have a Master Wu torso and legs with an Alien Force head pit print there. Pretty cool. I only have one of these, and this was a more expensive figure to get, I do believe. Uh, moving on to another one. I don't know what this guy's from, but he looks like he's from, like, Lord of the Rings or something. It does come with this sort of, like, a Jagger uh, skeleton of a piece in, like, a cream. Uh, he does look like an orc from uh, Lord of the Rings, but I'm not too sure. Please let me know in the comments down below what he is from. Because uh, the only thing I do know is, like, can figure out what he's from. He's like an orc from Lord of the Rings. That's what he resembles to me. I don't know what else Lego has, uh, or what other character this could be, other than the orc from Lord of the Rings. Um, it is quite a strange figure. A uh, very detailed face print. I can't sit and tell you that much. And moving on to this abomination, which is a gladiator Darth Maul. Uh, yeah, there's not much else to say. It's Darth Maul, but it's a gladiator. Um, cool Darth Maul head to have as a custom. Uh, could be useful for, like, some other people. I don't know. Um, don't know what I could use that for. And the last figure on the list is this guy. This is a robot cop from the Lego, uh, movie sets. He is a very useful suit that I can use there. Some nice hair as well. A robot head, which probably won't get used, but is still good. Uh, really cool. Uh, and I'm glad I got these. These are a lot of figures, so I expect a lot of customs coming soon from all these pads that I got. Uh, so other than that, hope you enjoyed. See you all next one. Have a nice day, and goodbye. So have a nice day, Seth.